Determining the stability of a slope can easily be done using plexus. Using a strength reduction technique, plexus will find the slip surface with the lowest factor of safety. But it will only find that one. Sometimes you would like to know the safety factor against sliding for other points. Using limbed equilibrium, like GeoStudio Slope W, we can easily achieve this. Let's take this example, an embankment with different slope angles at both sides. Plexus will determine the one with the lowest factor of safety. But what is the factor of safety for the other side? We will use slope W analysis to determine this, using the limit equilibrium method converter. Selecting the appropriate phase and picking slope W, we can convert the model. Inside the GeoStudio slope W, we can set our entry and exit ranges for the slip surface to determine the factor of safety at the left hand side. This gives the same value as in Plexus 2D. We can also analyze the right-hand side, which gives a higher factor of safety. Now let's move to a more complex case, an embankment structure with different slope sections. The Plexus safety analysis determines the slip surface associated with the lowest factor of safety. But what about the upper slope and the upstream side? Let's convert the slope W to find out. After running the analysis in slope W, we can recognize the factor of safety for the lower slope, for the global stability, for the upper slope, and the upstream slope. As in Plexus, the slope with the lowest factor of safety is the lower one. We can do the same analysis in Plexus for this more complex tailing step. The Plexus analysis gives the most critical area at the lower slope. For the limit equilibrium analysis, we can run several analyses for the different parts, as the lower slope, the mid-range slope, and the global stability. When having a reinforced slope, we can also do this. The limit equilibrium method converter can also deal with reinforcements as soil nails. Then in slope W, we can run different analyses and even run the same model with less soil nails to evaluate the effectiveness of the soil nail design. To get more geotechnical insight in your slope stability problems, we can now easily convert a Plexus 2D analysis to a slope W analysis of the same model.